بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم سی ایس پرو یوزرز ان دس ٹوٹوریل وی ول لرن اباؤٹ میپ آبجیکٹ ان لاجک ا میپ از این آبجیکٹ دیٹ کین بی یوزڈ ٹو ڈسپلے اینڈ کنٹرول این انٹریکٹو میپ آئی ہیو اے لسٹنگ ڈیٹا ان وچ دا جی پی ایس کوارڈینیٹس آر کیپچرڈ فار ایچ ہاؤس ہولڈ ویو کوارڈینیٹس آن دا میپ وی ول یوز ٹو ڈفرنٹ میتھڈس لاجک اینڈ میپ کیس لسٹنگ from the menu first we will use the map case listing from the menu open listing application click on the option and then select map case listing in the map case listing dialog check show the case listing on a map option and choose the variables in your data dictionary where the coordinates latitude and longitudes of each case is stored Now press OK to continue. Save your application. Deploy your application on the device to view the result. Run the application on the device. Enter login ID and click next to proceed. Choose start work activity from the drop down menu. Now to exit the listing application screen. Press the back button. You can view all of the coordinates from your listing data on this screen. It is the first method to view the coordinates. Now we will use logic to view the coordinates on the map. Open menu application. We have two variables. Login ID and activities. To begin, we will add a listing dictionary to the menu application to obtain latitude and longitude information click file and then select add file select the dictionary from the listing application we used latitude longitude and result variables in the external dictionary press logic icon to write the logic in the activities procedure declare user defined function view work on map in the activities procedure first we will declare a map in globally You can declare locally in functions or procedures. Give the name view map with map statement. You have the option of changing the name of the view map. I am using three functions in view work on map function. Add listing function, set base map, and show function. First, view the add listing function logic. To associate a data file with the external dictionary, use the set file function and give the data file name. In the add listing function, the for case statement executes one or more statements repeatedly within a loop for each case in a file opened as external dictionary. In our case, the dictionary name is listing underscore dict. On the next line, place a marker on the map at the specified latitude and longitude. In the rest of the lines, we will set the marker color based on the interview result. If the interview is completed, the marker color will be magenta and will include the household number. If the interview is partially completed, the marker color will be yellow. and will include the household number and so on after and if we will use description function to add result household number and ea number on the marker after the forecast loop the set base map function will set the map as satellite imagery the map will be displayed on the third line run the application to view the result enter user id and select option 2 from the drop down menu now compare the map with the logic if the result is completed the marker displayed household number with magenta color if the result is partially completed the marker displayed household number with yellow color if household is locked 
then the marker color is black. If the household refused to give the interview, then the color is red. Now move your cursor on the marker. The description function display the marker description. If over on the magenta color, the description details will be as follows. Interview status, household ID, and EA number. And status will be completed. If the cursor over on the yellow, the status will be partially completed with household ID and EA number. If the cursor moves on the black color, the status will be locked and for red, the status will be refused in the description box. For more detail, please see CS Pro Help on Map Object. Keep on learning and goodbye.